And good morning, meteorologist Jesse Kelly here live from Wilson. I hope everyone will have a fantastic Friday. Waking up to yet another humid star. Seeing temperatures right now to the middle to even the upper 70s. We have lots of moisture outside, so that's, of course, it's not allowing for temperatures to really cool off um, that much. But we will see lower humidity in the forecast. I'll talk more about that in just a little bit. 78 degrees here in the Shreveport, 74 degrees down towards Natchitoches, and seeing temperatures into the upper 70s across the Queen, Texarkana, also into Magnolia for temperature uh, 77 degrees. Winds right now light out of the southwest between 5 to 10 miles an hour or so. Again, feeling very humid this morning, and this building is this morning throughout most of the Arkansas Texas doing decent between 5 to 10 miles an hour. So, I won't be surprised if we see some patchy fog in some spots of the Arkansas. But today, though, it's going to be very quiet, similar to the last couple of days. And the reason why, because we have this big H over the area, which is a area of high pressure over the region, but the region of high pressure begin to break down and shift further off towards the west, which will allow for a up level trough to make its way across the uh, the eastern half of the United States, which will bring in a cold front, well, a cool front, excuse me, which will give us a good chance of showers and thunderstorms for your Monday into your Tuesday. But for today, though, we'll see a temperature of 95 degrees here in the Treeport, 94 degrees in Marshall, 94 degrees in Texas, Canada. We'll see a temperature at around 94 degrees also down towards Natchitoches. So, Ron Twitch Cash shows today a very uh, nice afternoon. We'll see those um, clouds mixing out this afternoon. Again, looking very lovely. So, if you have any outdoor plans today, it's looking pretty nice, but also be sure you're exercising heat safety, not only for uh, today, also exercising heat safety for at least the next couple of days, as again, we'll still feel like temperatures also to the triple digits out there, and for tonight, we'll still temperatures falling back down to the 70s, although this model is showing that we could see a few showers out there, I doubt it, just because we have high pressure over the region, but high pressure will begin to break down and shift further off towards the west for exciting and Sunday which will allow for a few scattered showers for your Sunday, but better rain chances for your Monday and also for your Tuesday. The reason why is, again, here's the ridge of high pressure over the region. That will begin to break away, shift off towards the north and west. We'll see a trough of low pressure built over the eastern half of the United States, which will also help push in a cool front for your Monday and for your Tuesday. Tuesday. So we'll see scattered showers and thunderstorms for Monday, also for your Tuesday. And then we'll see those rain chances begin to dwindle by Wednesday as we'll see lower humidity into the forecast which would feel very nice to give us a break from all the humidity that we have seen over the last couple of days, even for the last week or so. But rainfall amounts to this next system, not expecting that much of rain, maybe about a quarter to about a half an inch of rain. Could see higher amounts out there to about an inch, but again, not expecting any flash flooding concerns, just seeing some scattered showers and thunderstorms for your uh, Monday, also for your Tuesday, then seeing things tapering off by your Wednesday. But for today, though, your day plan is showing temperatures again starting off to the upper 70s, a very humid start. By the afternoon, though, we'll see temperatures to the upper 80s around noon. We'll see a temperature here in the street for again, middle 90s. Feel um, like it's into the triple digits outside, so make sure you're practicing heat safety. And next seven days shows a quiet picture for today. Same thing for your Saturday. Again, a few isolated thunderstorms are possible for your Sunday, but again, we'll see better rain chances for Monday and Tuesday with the front into the region, and then we'll begin to drop for your Wednesday and Thursday, and see those lows falling back down to the middle to upper 60s, the lower humidity by Wednesday and Thursday morning. Everyone have a great weekend.